Simon from Origin FX, I'm here at NAMM 2020 with Vintage King, just talking about a couple of new pedals from Origin FX. First off, we have got the Revival Trem, which builds on the technology of our Revival Drive and reproduces the sound of this bad boy. So I, I bought this on a trip to the States because I really love the sound, it's a classic amp, and I had to carry it around for three weeks and uh, it lived in lots of hotel rooms with me but it's got a brilliant uh, bias tremolo on it. And uh, when you crank it up, it sounds like a little Marshall. It's got like a, somewhere between, it's almost like a, a tweed kind of overdrive, but uh, with a bit more towards the black face, but it's a great amp. So uh, what I did was I opened up the amp and looked at every stage and replicated that using discrete transistors and JFETs. And it's got like a reactive sort of load in it to, to um, reproduce the way a guitar speaker and a guitar amp interact to produce like a really good kind of wiry, dynamic, bright and just real sounding guitar tone. So yes, we call it a tremolo pedal, but you can turn the tremolo on and off and with the tremolo off, you can use it as a drive pedal and there's, there's a lot of drive there. It's really realistic, really good. So. Uh, Apart from just producing a fantastic sound, you've also got a tap tempo function. You can uh, connect it to like a, a MIDI control system and actually set the, the, the tremolo the speed that way. And you can use a foot switch to disengage or engage the tremolo effect. So it's really versatile. Uh, with a tap tempo, you've got uh, three different speeds, multiplier speeds. So you can have like a triplet or a quaver uh, effect on, the, on there. Uh, and like the Revival Drive, we have a powerful post-EQ section with a three-position switch that allow you to use the pedal directly into a power amp or a speaker IR or into a bright amp such as a Blackface Fender or a darker amp like a Marshall with the inputs bridged. And the idea is that you can fly into a studio date or, or in, into a, like a, a fly date and you can turn up and just whatever backline you, you find yourself with, you'll be able to quickly dial the pedal in to get your consistent sound through that particular rig. Um, yeah, part of the thing I like about the bias tremolo is unlike other tremolos, it doesn't fight with the guitar so much. So as you kind of dig in harder with your playing dynamics, you can actually play beyond the tremolo effect. So you could have play like a lead line where the, you don't hear the tremolo, but then as the dynamics, as the notes tail off, the tremolo effect comes back in. So when you play soft chords, you have tremolo. When you kind of dig into a, a little lead line or something, the tremolo just kind of steps aside and lets the guitar through. So it's very cool. Let's see what you think. <laughs> Also at the show, we have released a limited run of Revival Drive hot rod units. So this is the big Revival Drive that we released 18 months ago. And, and that unit replicated the sound of late 60s guitar amps, such as um, Marshall Plexis and uh, like a Blackface Fender Twin, all these kind of classic amps, AC30s, this kind of stuff. And uh, you know, that was an, a, an important moment that defined amplification. But what happened next was that you would buy, you could buy these amplifiers used, you know, in like the early to mid 70s. And uh, you would take them to your amp tech who would take this two channel amp and essentially make one channel. And with the spare valve, they could cascade that into the one channel to give the amp a lot more gain. And so that you know that's that then became a, a hot rodded JTM 45 or or you know if it was a Fender it might become a boogie or whatever. 
So that's what we've done with the revival drive, and, and we've given it extra gain and a slightly more kind of mid-range focused voicing and it does that kind of mid 70s through to kind of 80s classic rock kind of sound so i guess the the, the plexi would have become something more akin to a jcm 800 um yeah it's a lot of fun and it's a lot of gain but uh yeah again just have a listen and let's uh, see what you think but, uh, yeah, thanks very much and enjoy the show.